is the main square. I'm facing the front section of the actual entrance and I notice this image here it looks like a center being and it's it's the same person looking to the left looking to the right waving one arm left one arm right and if it's anything like what I've seen at um, Abu Simbel and they talked about the animation I think this is the same thing I think it's it's animating the person as if if you had a flip book a sketchbook and you were flipping the pages and it looked like the person was moving because the heads are stabbing I mean, there's multiple people coming out it's really cool so here we are coming into the inner courtyard wow look at that That's impressive. Every space was utilized to carve something. There's no dead space. All the pieces that are missing are just broken off or stolen, cracked on purpose, whatever. But every space is utilized. There's not a single dead space. This one is much better preserved, although I still can't tell if the, the cap is uh, a separate piece. A really impressive work. It's smooth to the touch. If they had polished it, it would have been amazing. So if, if this is from the late, late period, I'm trying to find any evidence I can of machining, um, but so far nothing. Now these columns, very interesting, although massive, and they're at least 30 feet tall with giant blocks on top, they appear to be in more than one piece which is very different than some of these other places we've been to where the pillars are one solid chunk of granite um, without any cuts and they are equally as big, equally as heavy, sometimes heavier because I think this is a lighter malleable stone. I think this is sandstone. I'm not sure, but uh, although impressive, we've seen heavier and just as tall, if not taller, uh, pillars that were made of harder rock at other sites that were far more ancient, so it goes to show something. This is now the inner, inner part. You can hear the pigeons. There's all that black material up there, I'm not sure what it is. I don't know if it's like fire residue or what. Just hope they don't pull on me. They're making quite a fuss up there. I just found this little side door here, little side tunnel, and try to go through it. <whistles> Looks like it goes to a closed off area. And right back down. Although there's a little more area over here. 
Hello? It's pitch black. Let's see if I turn on my light. All right, here we go. Oh, it still keeps going. Well, if there's one thing I've learned, it's we should always explore. I'm not sure if I'm supposed to be back here, but there's no uh, no sign that says you can't. This is interesting. These guys look like priests. It looks like they're holding some kind of a, a box with something inside. Maybe something holy. Same thing over here. This is awesome. I feel like I'm exploring something new. Oh, and sadly, locked door. Looks like it leads to an upper area somewhere. Well, that's still cool. So now I've just rounded out back into the Holy of Holies, I believe. I'll show it to you in a second, but this is what the, uh, the chamber next to it looks like. If there's one thing I remember from Abu Simbel and the Holy of Holies there was that they designed the doorway to shine light on this area naturally. But the narrow uh, corridor would only show light on a certain area. So if this is in the original placement, then it's being lit the way it's supposed to be without the artificial lights on the side, of course. Turn on my light. Oh, unfortunately, those are scratch marks. So, all over Egypt, I've seen where they're scratching out faces and scratching out any images they don't seem to like. Interesting room. You can see another scratch mark of the, the eagle or falcon up there. Scratch marks here. <laughs> All this stuff's been scratched out as far as they could get. Looks like they left the top alone. See all the stars at the top. This is an adjoining room to the one I was just in, and the stars are uh, better preserved on here than any other room, so I just wanted to show you.
this is interesting because we saw something very similar to this um, at uh, Komombo yesterday, except the vase with the possible representation of water was pointed down. And here it looks like it's going over the top of them. Oh, that's Cleopatra. Yeah, this cartouche. Uh huh. This king, you know, but come from. Oh, awesome. Uh, Cleopatra Sephir. That's the the famous yeah. Cleopatra. Yeah. The one who died by the snake. Music. music. Oh, awesome. So this is the her symbol. Yeah. Cleopatra. Wow. This an offering. Uh huh. And here, incense. Incense. Incense, okay. And open, up here. Up here. And the roof, you pray. Oh, okay, so you carry the incense through here and you go yes. pray on the roof. Uh, why is the roof closed? I want to go. <laughs> uh huh. Oh, awesome. Your horse. Yeah. The sun points directly at Horus. Oh wow, cool. That's a Coptic cross? So they, that's after. They're the ones who scratched everything. This is the size. This Horus. Mm-hmm. Awesome. This Karabe. Uh huh. What's that? Kolei and the horse. Oh, okay. Hat horse, this kolei. Kolei hat horse. Uh huh. Kolei hat horse. Oh, okay. This is stars. Mm hmm. To represent the sky. Yeah. Cool. So this is Cleopatra's temple? Yeah. Cleopatra, the seven. Cleopatra's yeah. seven temple. Awesome. This year the sun will pray here. Oh, you pray here when the sun yeah. comes straight down. Yeah. Yeah. Uh-huh. Oh, cool. So it's the sun god temple as yeah. well, Cleopatra and sun god. Yes. Cool. Nine meters here, nine meters, and water ten here. And it goes down nine it's meters? Water here, yeah. Oh, so it, it starts there, uh huh. And it's all the way yeah. down? How many meters down? No, no, this is here. Oh, it's to here. Okay, and then it comes up. Yeah. So this is a sacred water. Yes. Wow. Awesome. Where does the water come from? Yeah. Underground? Uh, yeah, underground. And you turn the Nile. Nile. Oh, from the Nile, and yeah, then it comes underground yeah. to here. Okay. See temple. Uh huh. You make it here. See corridor here. Mm hmm. Here. Oh, that's the map. Yeah. This is the map of the whole yeah. temple. Yeah. Which corridor are we in? Corridor here. This is us. Yes. Here. Okay, we go all the way around and. This corridor. Here. This is the Holy of Holies here. Yeah. Wow. Cool. Is there underground yeah. secret passages? Yes. But not open? Yeah. It's too bad. <laughs> mm hmm. This, and you set, and is this Osiris? You set. Is this Osiris? Set. Mm -hmm. You set here. And the Horus you got. Oh, this is what I was looking for. Yeah. Oh, you found it. Okay. Sure. This is very, very important. This, uh, uh huh. So, Isis, Osiris. No, Horus. Oh, Horus. Isis, Horus. Yeah. And this is them set. 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 And they're killing them. Yes. Wow. Uh huh. Uh huh.
And he's he's dead. Yeah. They killed him. Wow, this is what I was looking for. <laughs> so Isis and Horus yes. and their killing set down below. Mm -hmm. Uh-huh. So they're celebrating Horus. Yeah. You finished your blood. Said's dead. Yeah. They're cutting oh they're cutting him now. Wow. Cool. Good. So again, Horus. Horus Hathor. Hathor. But Lamos. Oh, okay. And Osiris. And Osiris. And they're all holding hands because yeah. they're friends. This Horus. <laughs> uh huh. Cool. Excellent. And looks like we're back into the center courtyard. Downtown Edbu in the Aswan province. So this is our cruise ship. They say it's five stars. Uh, well, 